How's it going movie fans? The 17th of June 2023 is the 60th birthday of actor Greg Kinnear. A Golden Globe and Academy Award nominated actor, over the course of his acting career which began with his first on-screen appearance with a made-for-TV movie in 1988, followed by his feature film debut in 1994, Kinnear has proven himself as a reliable supporting actor or leading man, capable of taking on any genre of film. Kinnear currently has two projects in production, including Sight, which is due for release later in 2023. Here are the Firewall's top 10 Greg Kinnear movies. At number 10 is The Gift. Wayne Collins, played by Kinnear, is the school principal in Brixton, Georgia, who is engaged to Jessica King. But after Jessica goes missing, the search begins, but it is clairvoyant fortune teller Annabelle Wilson, who starts having visions about Jessica's fate and provides this information to the local police. The runtime's on 11 minutes, and The Gift has the follow rating of 6.7 out of 10. At number 9 is Autofocus. In this biographical drama, based on the book titled The Murder of Bob Crane, Kinnear plays Bob Crane, a radio personality turned actor, who in the 1960s goes from clean-cut family man to woman-obsessed sex addict, aided by his friendship with electronics expert John Henry Carpenter. The runtime's on 5 minutes, and Autofocus has the follow rating of 6.9. At number 8 is You've Got Mail. In this romantic comedy, inspired by the 1937 play titled Parfum Marie, Kathleen Kelly runs an independent bookstore and begins an anonymous friendship with a man she met in a chat room. Little does she know that she is corresponding with Joe Fox of Fox Books, a megastore which is threatening Kelly's business. Kinnear plays Frank Novaski. The run time's on 19 minutes, and You've Got Mail has the follow rating of 7. At number 7 is Stuck On You. Walt Tenner, played by Kinnear, is one half of a pair of conjoined twins who runs a diner called Quickie Burger in Martha's Vineyard with his brother Bob. But as a part-time actor, Walt has ambitions of moving to Hollywood to pursue an acting career. But when the pair arrive, the reality of the struggle they face begins to set in. The run time's on 18 minutes, and Stuck On You has the follow rating of 7. At number 6 is We Were Soldiers. This war drama, based on the book titled We Were Soldiers Once and Young, depicts the first major battle in the American phase of the Vietnam War in 1965, which sees a US battalion led by Colonel Hal Moore face overwhelming odds in their fight against the Vietnamese army. Kinnear plays helicopter pilot Major Bruce Crandall. The run time is 138 minutes, and We Were Soldiers has the follow rating of 7.1. At number 5, is Little Men. Two 13-year-old boys, Jake and Tony, quickly become friends when Jake's family, including his father Brian Jardine, played by Kinnear, and his mother move into the apartment above Tony's mother's dress shop. But a dispute over rent threatens to tear the friendship apart. The run time is 85 minutes, and Little Men has the follow rating of 7.2. At number 4 is Invincible. Based on the true story of Vince Papali, who in 1976 is a 30-year-old bartender who attends an open tryout for players looking to join NFL team the Philadelphia Eagles. Kinnear plays Dick Vermeil, the new head coach of the Eagles, whose decision it was to host the open tryouts. The run time's on 5 minutes, and Invincible has the follow rating of 7.3. At number 3, is as good as it gets. Kinnear received an Academy Award nomination for Best Actor in a Supporting Role for his performance as Simon Bishop, an artist whose neighbour is Melvin Udall. Udall is a best-selling novelist who suffers with OCD and doesn't get along with many people but does fall for a waitress at a local restaurant. The run time's on 39 minutes and as good as it gets has the follow rating of 7.5. At number 2, is Brigsby Bear. In this comedy drama, having been abducted as a child and held captive in an underground bunker, James is raised by kidnappers posing as parents and a fake educational television show called Brigsby Bear. After being freed by police and introduced to his real parents, James attempts to adapt to his new life. Kinnear plays Detective Fogel. The run time's 97 minutes, and Brigsby Bear has the follow rating of 7.8. At number 1, is Little Miss Sunshine. Richard Hoover, played by Kinnear, is a motivational speaker and life coach, as well as a father and a husband, who agrees to take his dysfunctional family on a road trip from New Mexico to California, after finding out that his young daughter has qualified to take part in the Little Miss Sunshine beauty pageant. The run time's on 1 minute, and Little Miss Sunshine has the file rating of 8.5. Thanks for watching, next week I'll be counting down the file's top 10 upcoming movies of 2023 between July and December, and if you enjoyed this list, please don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe.